Crash Team Rumble has a strange comeback mechanic that isn't well known. In fact, I'm pretty sure that me and a friend were the first to find out about it. So, what is it, you ask? Well, let me explain. Welcome to Engine Labs, a little series I'm starting about Crash Team Rumble mechanics that have yet to be explored, or aren't very well known. The purpose is to get this information out there so that more people are able to understand how the game works. There's a lot of things Toys or Bob don't tell you, and I'm here to tell you for them. Have you ever noticed the amount of relics you get from killing someone? It varies depending on how many relics your opponent had. If your opponent had 0 to 7 relics, you'll get 1 for killing them. If they had between 8 and 11, you'll get 2 relics. And if they had 12 to 15, you'll get 3. This sounds pretty straightforward, and means that if you see a Coco zooming around the map, they likely have 15 relics, and you'll get 3 if you manage to kill her. But. If that was all there was to it, I wouldn't be making this video. There's a secret comeback mechanic in the game that me and a friend found out that changed how many relics you get when you kill someone. If your team is behind in Wumpa by 223, and I'm not making that number up, it really is that specific, you'll get an extra relic if the person you killed had 15 relics. This isn't listed anywhere in the game guide, no loading screen tip says this, and Toys or Bob haven't mentioned this on their Twitter either. But it doesn't stop there. After the differential in scores hits 312 Wumpa, you get 5 relics when you kill someone with 15. And once it gets to 400, you can get 6 relics. 6 is the maximum amount we found you can get. You don't get any extra if you're more behind. So, next time you get more than one relic from killing someone, now you know where that came from. Thanks for watching. If you like this style of content, feel free to like the video and subscribe to the channel for more videos on stuff like this. Also, be sure to follow my Twitch. I stream Rumble there constantly, and we get up to some crazy shenanigans. Thanks for watching, and I will see you guys later. See ya!